Hey, this is Mirgloff, and this is Mirgloff Builds. And in today's video, I'm going to be building a monument to one of my subscribers. And let me tab out and get their name here, because it's a little bit difficult to remember. They are 3v4d35. So I'm going to build a monument to, for them to thank them for scribing, subscribing. And I'd also like to uh, thank a new subscriber for subscribing. And that would be... Uh, that would be Brian K. Grout. Thank you, Brian K. Grout, for subscribing. I hope you enjoy these videos. And I'm going to build uh, this monument on this hill over here. I pass by this uh, this way all the time when I want to get to any of the other towns. Although not so recently since I uh, built a pathway in the nether. But uh, we're going to begin construction now.
Alright, the monument to 3v4d45 uh, is complete, and I've decided to make it sort of a historical marker as well for the discovery of the location of Greenstone when the uh, people who originally settled it decided they would found this location. I decided to uh, why not have 3v4d45 be one of the founding settlers. And as these signs say, this stone marks the discovery of the Greenstone area. And uh, I, did, I was a little bit experimental about the uh, floor here, mostly because I was uh, trying to use up a uh, variety of uh, materials that I've had sitting around for a while. That's just generally how I come up with new looks and designs. This is by using weird stuff in ways that they generally aren't used. Also, I used the uh, upside down stair block feature of 1.2. And it's primarily out of wood, although it does feature some green mossy cobblestone for the namesake of greenstone. And there's some stone underneath and some stone slabs. And uh, that's all for this video. I haven't really done anything uh, off camera worth showing. So if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and leave a comment. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.